Film Review, Universal Language, Directed by Matthew Rankin. Reviewed by Naveed Nikha Azad. Universal Language, Directed by Canadian Filmmaker Matthew Rankin. Premiered on May 18th in the Director's Fortnight held in parallel to the 77th Can Film Festival. Rankin, known for his films showcased at major events such as Sundance, South by Southwest, ANSI, TIFF, The Berlin Ale, and Can Critics Week, brings a film that is both imaginative and rich in symbolism, continuously surprising its audience. Universal Language is a dark comedy blending absurdism and grotesque elements within its characters and subplots. Set in a mysterious and surreal inner zone between Tehran, Winnipeg, and Montreal, the film weaves the lives of multiple characters in unexpected ways. The Persian title, Avaz e Bugal Amun, Turkey's Song, symbolizes communication and social interaction, a recurring motif throughout the film. In this depicted dystopia, the missing link is communication, with characters seeking ways to connect with one another. Another central motif is interconnectedness, emphasizing that each person is part of a larger human collective. Losing this connection can lead to destruction in this desolate world, suggesting that mutual care is vital for survival. Near the film's end, the character Masood tells Rankin, just as Assiniboine joins the Red River and together they flow into Lake Winnipeg, we are all connected. The film's structure and elements resemble a nightmare. From its geography to its characters, plot progression, and symbolic elements, it feels like a bizarre, maddening dream. Nothing in the film is normal, natural, or grounded in tangible reality. Like a nightmare, events lack logic and reflect the subconscious. The omnipresent snow, portraying a cold winter, symbolizes a winter sleep. Rankin's writing and direction show influences from renowned Iranian filmmakers like Abbas Kiarostami. Scenes in a classroom where the teacher, Monsieur Bilodeau, asks children about their future careers evoke Kiarostami's homework, 1989. Similarly, Scenes where Nagin and Natskal search for Hafez Gamgosar to borrow his axe are reminiscent of Kiarostami's Where is the Friend's House? 1987. Rankin depicts a dystopia in the near future, devoid of blessings. People have turned to selfishness, hedonism, and consumerism. For instance, trees are cut down, nature destroyed, so people can enjoy the view, and nothing remains of ancient relics. The character Masood, a tour guide, mentions that a forgotten suitcase has been registered as an artifact by UNESCO. The film's world is also filled with slogans suggesting an ideal city, hiding a reality of worthlessness. One such slogan on a city banner reads, A strong economy helps to prevent feelings of worthlessness. In Rankin's film, little of Canadian and Western culture remains. Canadian characters are rare and, when present, speak Persian. Most Persian-speaking characters work for Canadians, highlighting a commentary on a devouring culture. A strong motif in the film is birth, fertility, and motherhood. Near the end, we meet the mother of the character Matthew, who symbolically represents the mother of all characters, suggesting they all emerge from her womb. Early in the film, a turkey steals the glasses of Masood's son. In a later scene, one of the girls wrestles with the turkey, retrieves the glasses, and returns them to Masood's son. When he puts on the glasses, the roles of Masood and Matthew swap, signaling that we may misinterpret the world because we lack the correct perspective. The filmmaker invites the audience to put on their glasses and view the world, humanity, and life with clarity and truth. In summary, Universal Language by Matthew Rankin is a dark comedy that intertwines absurdism and rich symbolism. Set in a surreal world between Tehran and Winnipeg, it delves into themes of communication and interconnectedness, reflecting a dystopian future where isolation and cultural loss prevail. Influences from Iranian cinema, particularly Abbas Kiarostami, add layers to its narrative. The film's dreamlike structure and motifs encourage viewers to consider the significance of perspective and connection in understanding the human condition.